Hello boys and girls, what we've got for you today is the all new rebooted Asus Zenfone Max. Don't worry, it's not as big as its new brand ambassador, but pretty much looks like the old Max. So without any further ado, let's get started with our first impressions of the Asus Zenfone Max. Now the biggest improvement that this smartphone has got is the processor. Earlier they used to use a Qualcomm Snapdragon 410 processor which was a quad core processor and now they bumped the processing speed to a 1.5 GHz octa core processor, specifically the Qualcomm Snapdragon 615 chipset. What it means is a boost in performance. But in the past we've noticed heating issues when phones have been using this processor. Now they've also made 32 GB storage on it as standard. The other difference is that this phone comes in two variants, a 2 GB RAM variant and a 3 GB RAM variant. The display remains the same at 5.5 inches and you get a 13 megapixel camera at the back with laser focus and a 5 megapixel front camera for your selfies. Now the phone is thick and the reason behind that is the massive 5000 milliampere battery which is also the USB of this smartphone and they give you a small OTG cable inside the box where you can use the smartphone as a battery bank as well to charge your secondary device if this is not your secondary device. And that's about it. For people looking for longer battery life, this smartphone is a no-brainer. But if you want a little more from this smartphone, wait for a full review to come out very soon on this channel and then decide whether you want to buy the smartphone or not. 